When you're looking to buy a diamond, you'll notice that the clarity has a large impact on the price and may or may not make a difference to the appearance of the stone to the naked eye. The clarity is a measurement of the amount of impurities and imperfections trapped within the diamond when it was formed over 1 billion years ago. The clarity grade is given to the diamond by assessing the quantity, type and position of inclusions within the stone. The clarity grades are assessed at 10 times magnification. The highest clarity grade is flawless, and this means that there are no impurities in the diamond visible at 10 times magnification. Next down the scale is VVS1 and VVS2. VVS stands for very, very small, and at this level the impurities will resemble 5 to 10 microscopic specks of dust within the stone. This level of clarity is very rare, and you certainly can't see the impurities with the naked eye. The next step on the scale is VS1 and VS2, where VS stands for very small. Here, the size and quantity of inclusions are getting more prevalent, although they are still not visible to the naked eye in a round brilliant cut diamond. VS2 is probably the most popular level of clarity, and it's often a good balance between the appearance of the inclusions and its price. It also tends to be good psychologically, as you'll know that the inclusions in your diamond are very small and insignificant. Next after the VS level is SI1 and SI2. SI stands for small inclusions. Here is a classic SI1 clarity. This particular diamond contains a feather, which is a type of inclusion, and it's the main reason that this stone has been classified as an SI1. This is in fact quite a typical SI1 clarity. The inclusion is positioned just off what's known as the table of the diamond, which makes it less visible to the eye. Next is SI2. This is the level where the inclusions are getting quite a lot larger and more obvious, and then can sometimes be seen with the naked eye. In fact, I'd estimate that around 30-40% to 40 of the inclusions of an SI2 clarity diamond are visible. There are quite a lot of differences between individual diamonds which are graded at this level. It's therefore important to check the diamond from the side, as often the inclusion from above may be obscured by the facets in the crown, whereas from the side the inclusion could be easily visible. This does mean that it's important that the diamond has to be checked fully prior to purchase. Beyond SI2 are the levels known as PK1, PK2 and PK3. In the American terminology, these are also known as I1, I2 and I3. These diamonds do have obvious flaws when viewed carefully and are considered typical commercial quality. So this means that most of the uncertified diamonds that, for example, you might find on the high street will be somewhere between a PK1 and PK2 level.